In 2015, MCI celebrated Singapore's Jubilee Year of SG50. Our mission to connect our people to community, government and opportunity was accomplished through various programs and initiatives. I think libraries do bring people together. They are actually a great leveler. Once you are in a library, you are just like the person next to you. It doesn't matter what race, what economic status you come from. You're just there to read a book, to enjoy reading. Archiving helps to maintain our history and it keeps memories alive. We have to build upon our past. We have to learn from the mistakes that were made and we have to take the good points. And it is only then we will be able to appreciate our present. I still remember a time when the media industry was very niche, but today, we see a growing, vibrant industry which has been able to reflect our aspiration as Singaporeans and uh, find its own footing amidst international content. To the credit of MCI, they are willing to listen to ideas. If you have an idea which flies, it's far more easier to get some support to see it through. That's how the environment has evolved and matured. Design definitely enabled the businesses to service their customers better and the public sector to serve the people better. In terms of design, we have come a long way, but it's not enough. If we can grasp that, then I think the opportunity is almost limitless because Singapore is very well placed with all the world connection, with all the knowledge and the experiences uh, and the respect we are getting from a very hungry world. I guess for young entrepreneurs, sometimes starting up is really not easy. So IDA Beyond you know, Accelerator programs it also has initiatives such as IPACT, which helps foster partnerships among startups and larger companies. I think BASH is probably the most important thing IDA has done for both. And I think they have designed the environment in such a way that fosters greater interaction among the startups. So it's great for you to you know, cross-pollinate ideas across various experiences, nationalities and more.政府是怕建国一代的前辈们啊Cybersecurity, especially in the past, is always a want to have. Now it has transited to a next phase, which is a need to have. So, end of the day, it's really everybody's responsibility. Be it in terms of homeland defense, in terms of external defense, in terms of defending your business or your personal data, your personal information. So, in that sense, everybody has to come together, be it the people, be it the companies, the organizations, the government agencies, the ministries. Everybody has to come together to really secure and harden these infrastructures to make sure that when we use the cyberspace, it's safe for us to use. Even as MCI looks back on our achievements, we'll continue to partner with people and agencies in the private and public sectors to improve the lives of our citizens in the way we live, work and play. Thank you for what you've done and let's continue to make a difference for Singapore's future.